Health officials are warning folks here in downtown Mystic to stay away from any wild animals and keep your pets safe. That after someone living in this cul-de-sac says he watched a skunk die right in front of him, foam coming out of his mouth. There were also two other skunks which were seen walking on nearby roads erratically and lethargically, which is typical for rabid animals. Those skunks were removed but not tested for rabies. There was no known contact with any people or pets. Being that you've worked here for five years, have you seen skunks in the area? Um, I've seen them around the summertime, actually at nighttime, out in the parking lot behind the store. They don't bother anybody. Katie O'Reilly works in downtown Mystic and used to live here as well. The skunk she and others would see appeared harmless, but with suspect sightings nearby, folks are urged to beware. Well, a lot of people around this time are coming, you know, for the shopping, so mm -hmm. that, that's kind of, I'll be worried, be walking around town. So far, there has been no reason to expect any disruption to the downtown shopping experience, enjoyed by so many, especially as the weather warms. Wouldn't bother me. I'd, I wouldn't go looking for them, and I think if I saw one, I'd walk the other way. But. Having lived here in downtown Mystic myself, I have also had a run-in with a skunk. I was actually sitting right on this bench a few years ago when a skunk walked right by and up toward the bridge. We ended up getting up, and we walked here around the corner. When we turned around, that skunk was running after us, and we had to run into the building. So you never know with wild animals, and that's why health officials are warning people to be cautious. On the scene in downtown Mystic, Tina Detell, News 8.